What's good, YouTube? This your boy, DJQ Waves. Back again with another new video. If you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that red subscribe button and notification bell. If you're a subscriber, welcome back to the channel. So it looks like Anna Sapak recently revealed a new tattoo that he got, which warned people not to drop no unreleased speech after he dies. The tattoo reads, when I'm gone, Please don't release any posthumous albums or songs with my name attached. Those were just demos and never intended to be heard by the public. And this comes after a string of artists have had albums released after their death, including Prince, Posmo, Mac Miller, Juice World, and XX Titation. Now, Posmo's most recent album, Faith, was criticized by some fans and former collaborators, such as his friend and other people in the industry who took issue with the original Beats being reworked and feature removed. And and he felt like, you know, like Mark D said, he felt like Posmo and his project, some of the music, is believed that that's his only music he had left. Now, and it's bad, like, look, y'all ain't gonna do that to me. Y'all not gonna drop all of my demo songs and all my songs and stuff like that to the public and they not that good so yeah so like he letting them be known like he letting them know be known before he go away like y'all ain't gonna do that to me but y'all let me know what y'all think about all these strings of artists music being released and do y'all like we know we fans of these great artists but do y'all really want songs that's not finished you know it's not this it's not the great quality of music you know what i'm saying uh, you know what we usually get from the artists. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about what Anderson Pack had to say about this. And as always, if you want more videos like this, always be sure that DJQ Ways playlist about the video. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe button, and notification bell. Peace. DJQ Ways. You so wavy.